Hey hey, Vault is here with the next update for the Portax Chronicles. Uh, really, really been leveling monsters like there were no tomorrow. Uh, sadly, doing that and evolving them, there isn't a lot to show for it. Um, I can show you that I am now up to uh, four of these uh, Rainbow Mons at five star. So we're only one short. Uh, of making the first 6 star for this account uh, which is also what I've uh, been working on um, since then and as you can see in the monster department here um, which we just looked down I've uh, been leveling a lot of uh, low uh, level monsters like these uh, monster flowers you can see they're level 3 and uh, uh, level 3 3 star and uh, I'm beginning to level them up, so I can evolve them to 4 star. So we in the end can use them to take one of these rainbow mons up here and evolve it to 5 star. So we have enough for the first 6 star. It is a lot of work, and um, I still need to make 3 more 4 stars. As you can see I have uh, Tatu here, which will be used as food, and then uh, these 3 are next. Uh, sadly, I'm if I'm doing hell level in time of desert, uh, I'm still only able to do it with two monsters. Um, I don't have a monster yet that can solo uh, solo it. <clears throat> but I've been using Aman and Darian uh, to do it. Um, uh, Darian is actually was actually just there to get the experience also. So I can now say that he is also max level uh, 5 star. And he uh, is closing in on 18,000 hit points. So uh, he's beginning to be quite a beast. Um, and also uh, a contender towards uh, Remagos. But uh, Remagos still has more hit points. Uh, but the main reason really is that uh, he's all energy. And Darian is energy violent. Uh, Darian's runes are a lot better than uh, Ramagos's. Uh, but they, he has been the focus for the level on the side. As I showed you last, uh, I haven't worked on the uh, Soha yet, uh, since I want to get the first 6 star uh, in the fold before I start working on her. She will however be the next focus. I, I really need to get her ruined and at least up to 5 star. And we'll take it from there. Uh, <clears throat> not a lot to show really for a, a few days work, but uh, since I cannot use crystals on ref, uh, refills, um, I can only use the energy that is uh, regen and given to me. So uh, it's been a slow process, but uh, we're getting there. As you can also see, uh, the account is now uh, halfway through level 35, and uh, upon hitting level 35, the account was given 300 crystals. Uh, I have also uh, been able to gather enough crystals around that, so that um, we now have enough for the next premium pack. Yeah, buddy! So, um, let's just go get that. Uh, so we can uh, get some more mystical scrolls and we need to claim them <coughs> there we go as you can see I've also saved up a little energy here and uh, that is definitely because I want to utilize this uh, 12 hour uh, double experience booster we were given as a login bonus as you can see, there are only two days left before it runs out, so I have to use it soon. But I do have stacked up a fair amount of energy already, so I can utilize it as uh, best as I can. So I can level up as much food monsters as possible. But that will be, well, maybe tomorrow, the day after. Time will tell. Um, the login bonus for today um, was... Uh, also a uh, light and dark scroll so we have that as well to use and i had two scrolls already 
So we're up to 13 mythical scrolls and a light and dark scroll today. And let's just uh, join some random channel 2468, I believe, will be the, uh, the best, <clears throat> I hope. <laughs> and uh, we'll just see what we get. Let me just check. Uh, oh, I have enough space for these new creatures. Now all these three stars will of course also help me uh, evolve faster. Um, actually I was also uh, lucky enough to get a, uh, a wind griffin as a drop from Tamar Desert. Um, so it can be used to skill up the Bernard. And we got a level up in his body slam. This is also a very nice bonus from farming Tamar Desert. But uh, yeah, the drop rate isn't great, but you get them now and then. So let's uh, let's see if we can get something good for this account. Uh, we we are missing the, the some good key players, I think, to be able to feel a very nice team. But we are beginning to have. Uh, Quite a lot of the key players of building a team. Um, it's always, I don't know about uh, you other free to play players out there, um, but going through the arena, you, I, I really think that it's quite often that you encounter some level 17, 25, whatever, with one or two natural five stars already. Um, how they do it, I don't know. Um, extremely lucky, or they have paid the, the price. I don't know, but it is a bit, uh, how do you say, uh, it's, n it's not the best feeling to see all those five stars out there and not have one of my own. But uh, let's see if uh, we can remedy that this tonight for this uh, Portex account. Um, let's see. Here we go, one scroll. And it's a salamander. Not really what we're looking for. And a bear man. Well, it can be used to uh, skill up uh, a man. So, well, might use it for that. I'm not sure yet. And we have a wind. Living armor as the next. Uh, still, I'm not able. Well, I don't want to build a copper for this account, uh, really. Um, it is a good unit if I uh, feel it great, but I really need some really good runes for it. So we'll just summon the next one, which will be a wind medical archer, I believe. Yep. Yeah. Uh, not what we're looking for either. Well, this can be utilized, uh, but it is a late game unit, uh, mainly because of this Teutonic Shift. Um, if you can build it correctly, it can one-shot uh, six-star units. Uh, it of course needs to be six stars uh, itself and have a lot of good runes. So for this account, this is too early to build a Kali, as the name is when she's awakened. So she will just be food for for this account for now. Um, and a wind battle mammoth, not exactly what we needed either. <clears throat> Still no lightnings, and we got Goland. No, thank you. More food. Mm, and we get a water fairy. No, not really either. Just, uh, oops, sorry. Drunken master. No, thank you. Four scrolls left. Let's really hope for this uh, what is it called? lightning summon. That's it. Uh, <clears throat> and we're gonna have a fire penguin knight. No. 
And here we here we go. Go on. Oh, is that a chess soon? It's a definite chess soon. Now, this is a really, really good unit. And one that I really, really, really want on my main account. But still don't have it. So uh, that's definitely a character that uh, I want to focus on for this account. She is an awesome healer. And, uh, well, she has some buff skills on the side as well. So very, very good addition. Very, very good indeed. And uh, let's see if we can get lucky with the next two. First one's just a three star. Uh, actually, hmm, don't I miss him for the evil uh, for the evolution to for the fusion really to make Vermos? I think I might. So um, yeah, we'll see if I have to keep him around. Mm, no lightning on these last mystical scroll either actually a two star natural born but that's all good uh, Chasun thumbs up for that that's a really really good summon very very happy about her so I bet I'll be uh, visiting the uh, wind element uh, halls of wind that is uh, to farm some elements to awaken her now uh, we do have one scroll left so uh, Come on, Iron Jesus, give me something good that is not farmable. Three, two, one. Lightning! No. <laughs> well, <laughs> I have to risk luck with these things. But, in all fairness, it saves me quite a lot of time to farm for this. This is a very, very, very good unit, um, and one that everyone should uh, should have. And getting this really completes my light trio of uh, Darian, Belladion, which is the name of this unit when awakened, and Amon. So, um, not a rare unit, but it's the definite unit that will help this account very, very much, and. He will also uh, be one of the focus points, really, uh, that I need to get up. So, uh, two uh, two good units. Um, debatable if you want to see that from a light and dark scroll, but for this account, I really do not mind. It saves uh, me a lot of time of uh, doing the uh, secret dungeon for him, and more so looking for someone that has that. Uh, so... Uh, I'm I'm pretty happy with the the, the summons here. Yeah? The Chisun is really really good, so <laughs> lock her down instantly. And also we need the light Inogami. Can we oh we are far from an awakening in anything. So we'll have to farm for that. Let's just check the Chisun as well. To see if we have any high elements. We don't have a single high and we used all the high magic we had. To uh, awaken Soha. So, definitely a lot of farming ahead, uh, but also uh, uh, leveling. So, well, it, uh, it was a good day for this account, really. Um, definitely going to use some of the double experience to level these uh, up to, to max level, so they are ready for evolution. So, um... I guess this is it for the update. Uh, very happy uh, account leveler here sitting in this chair. So uh, a lot more to do. Um, on a side note though, the Portax, uh, sorry, the Quail account I, will, I gave away at level 35, I will not be doing that uh, to the Portax account. Um, I probably will do uh, a lower level at all the way to level 40 um, and then see how uh, the state of the account is uh, at that point and see what I want to want to give it away there or level it a little further build the units better uh, I'm not sure yet but at least for now uh, level 40 is uh, the target level for the uh, giveaway of the account but uh, we'll get around to that later for for now 
This was the update for the Portex Chronicles. Uh, be safe out there, and this is uh, Wallace signing out. Bye bye.